These people are up and early making bread. Okay, you can't be bothered taking out the camera right now because it's too tired. Woke up at, well the alarm was at 6 o'clock. I didn't actually wake up at 6 o'clock because I was like, screw life. And we're going to Mont Saint Michel. So we're gonna catch a train. It takes about an hour and a half. And yeah, report back later. After much struggle and navigating our way through this confusing train station, we're here! So, <coughs> and we caught the train so we actually thought we could do stuff on the train but it was so quiet and <laughs> we have to get another bus to Mont Saint Michel. First coffee of the day. And also, our battery life is depleting very, very quickly. I'm like shaking my phone as I'm shaking it. Mm. Helps post to Instagram faster. Because we want to keep posting onto Instagram, I think that's like taking up most of the battery. We're on 40%, and it's only 10 o'clock. <laughs> It's very gloomy, as you can see, and quite cold. <laughs> and on the train, it was kind of like um, in Harry Potter, how it's kind of really foggy, and then the Dementors come to the window and start sucking your soul. At least we got some good old sleep, because last night, oh, pimple. When I set the alarm, it was like, all right, alarm set for four and a half hours. I'm like, great. Wow. We're here! Look at it. Oh my gosh. It's like this whole castle on a hill. Maybe that's what Ed Sheeran was singing about when he sang Castle on a Hill. Over the castle on the hill. Kidding, by the way. So like over here is all just water normally, but it's like low tide. I'm like, it's so bright. So when we were coming here on the shuttle, I'm like thinking we caught the wrong bus because I don't know, the directions here are actually quite hard to follow. Well, actually, correction. There are no directions. <laughs> I was gonna put my camera on and then realize there's this freaking <laughs> Yellow monster. Mon Wait, how do you say Mr. in French? I don't know. Monster? Monsieur? Mon -min monster? <laughs> no, I don't know, something like that, but it always sounds like cheese. There is Mia. As you can see, the hordes of tourists have caught up <laughs> and we are running away. And we are approaching the castle. Let's see if we can go inside. This seclusion on your own island is my type of living. <laughs> and then you just come out whenever you feel like people. Vastness! I felt like I haven't been in such open, spacious areas for so long. Wildlife. And then we enter. Are we still at Mont Saint Michel or are we in Diagon Alley? Gelato. <laughs> okay, going to the top of the tower. <gasps> yes! <laughs> Nothing! <laughs> Baron. Wow, that's cool. There was once a crab here, but crab no more. Womp womp. Yeah, this is like where they'd hide from and shoot. Well, they're not shooting much here. <laughs> <laughs> Rebound. We're going to make our way there. So these uh, steps are quite steep. Love it. 
most steps. Really pick the right shoes to wear today, huh? Mm -hmm. Getting closer. Also getting hotter. This seagull speaks French more fluently than we do. We're halfway up the mountain now. Not <laughs> the mountain. <laughs> We're halfway up the castle now. Is it a castle? Yes. And the sun has finally come out. Sweating. Bye. Goodbye. Bing, bing, bing. Do we want a photo here? This is a very flattering angle. Shall we just... <laughs> Let's just keep jumping. <laughs> and that, guys, is how you take a photo. Seriously, the only thing I'm thinking is like, if you were down there ready to head out and you forgot your keys, <laughs> and you have to go all the way here, no, that's only a problem that. But seriously, this walk is strenuous. Who's there? there? Billy? You're still there? We are going to take a tour of the Abbey. Something that I just realized today is that Felicia here is a child. <laughs> are you a child? Let me just explain myself. So apparently in Paris, they consider people eight. What is it? Eight? Under 25. Oh, under 25 a child. So. I still going? make that benchmark. <laughs> and then there should be like this indoor place with these cool arches. More steps. <laughs> Great. This is the olden bidets. Gosh. Oh wow. More stairs. <laughs> ah. This is where Valentino got their rock stud inspiration. <laughs> this is... 15 floors later, maybe? Look, we're just tiny little ants. And there's these like really strange statues. For example, this one looks like a starving giraffe. This one is like a sword shark. And there's these symbols that are on the floor. Don't know what they mean. Okay, so in here is the abbey and the people apparently of the Middle Ages regarded the inside to be the representation of like a heavenly earth. This woman, no leg day. Does it not look like Hogwarts or something? Wow. Yeah, that. This child is trying on infant sized hats. <laughs> I never worn a hat. Yeah, I was just gonna say, I've never seen you wear a cap. <laughs> yeah. I look at this. <laughs> oh, wait, I fit it. <laughs> you are a child. <laughs> but does it look weird if it's supposed to be for a child? Like, the proportions are off. <laughs> my head looks like a cone. <laughs> like a cone head. Oh my gosh. Dude, you know, when I was born, they actually had to prong me out of my mom's, like, vaginal. Why? Because I wouldn't come out, so then I had, like, a cone head. So you're touching on a very sensitive part of my life. So it's got where we are now. Arc de Triomphe, and we can't figure out what this is. Tell me below, what is it? All right, whatever, let's go with black. <laughs> is it me or does this look like a butthole? We're on the hunt for food now. Pick your poisons. <laughs> Digestive. <laughs> Hi, can I get the basic um, tuna sandwich? All right, guys, so this is actually <laughs> the first meal of the day we had a pastry in the morning mm -hmm. haven't even had my poo yet <laughs> okay. cheers just the tip 
So the castle was a solid workout for your glutes. Which is why we can eat this with no guilt. Chicken of the sea. So the castle was pretty cool. We're not really doing much today. Just going on a five hour bus ride back to Paris. If you guys are ever thinking about coming here, just be prepared that it will take a while. No, it's like plan wisely. I think we yeah. could have gone on the earlier bus if we didn't get lost yeah. <laughs> on the train station. Still made it in due time. Finished it. Damn you, Salazar! Drop my freaking hat. Now I have to walk down there like a peasant. Luckily, it's not like all the way in the trenches though. I am not I'll go, I'll go, I'll wearing go. the right... Wait, stay there. No, it's fine. Okay. Ew, but now there's sand all over it. <laughs> Alright guys, and we end the tour of Mont Saint Michel with our matching caps. <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh-uh. Yeah. <laughs> Before we say goodbye. These people just walking in the abyss. The long journey home. <laughs> Goodbye. So we find ourselves with no food, hungry, but we have a candlelit dinner. <laughs> We're sitting inside, but it like looks outside at the street. Classic French people watching. Right now it's like 11 p.m., so we're just gonna get this salad and I'm gonna get a pasta. Because we got off the bus. Because we got off the bus super hungry and we were on there for five hours. Which wasn't that bad because we slept throughout the entire thing pretty much. We slept for four hours out of five. Yeah. <laughs> just to pass time, you know. I feel so alive right now. <laughs> the night is young. <laughs> We're cranking the party tonight. <coughs> and my throat is dying. Whoa, the food they just came joke out. Brown when they say big salad. This smells so good. Midnight snack. Oh my god. Yeah, it's like 12 now. <laughs> This is bloody phenomenal. Tell me how good your salad is. Dude, this camembert. Fantastic. And this blue cheese. The bacon is not as salty as American bacon. They're not deal. We're at the lead.